new kind of angle thing here. Appreciate that. It's great to see your faces. Kurt will be back soon. Tomorrow. No, not yes. Tuesday. Yes. Monday. Monday. Tomorrow. That's tomorrow. Yeah. I would call that Sunday. Um, I didn't know if you wanted to say anything about his trip. Um. Okay. You know all. <laughs> Kurt went to um to take his mom to a doctor's appointment. Um, she does have stage four breast cancer, and they're going to schedule um, a mastectomy. But he's coming. We're not sure when she's going to have that. But she's in very good spirits, and they've had a wonderful weekend together. And she hasn't been out and off her porch for a year, and so every meal they've gone out to eat, <laughs> and they've gone and bought flowers, and she even bought herself a new pair of shoes. So. So um, it's a good thing, and um, but keep her in your prayers. So, even at 84, it's a tough diagnosis. So thank, thank you. you. Thanks for that. Mm -hmm. I did. Uh, I was tempted to show the picture on the, uh, yeah, on Facebook with a giant piece of chocolate cake. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I and I gotta tell you, I'm sure Kurt's watching, but when the picture of Kurt's mom and dad, and, and then that picture of Kurt's mom today. It's just so meaning, so yeah. I need her address so I can write her a note. Praise God. So, thank you. One of the other pictures you saw in there was Elizabeth. Oh, I know. JW. JW was here Thursday. And, you know, I know he was he was early and small, but he is not small anymore. <laughs> He's mighty. And, you know, beautiful to see, and Elizabeth just looks great. Uh, continue prayers for that new family as well. Pray for, for Kurt's traveling mercies as he travels back. Are there any prayers of the people that you would like to share? Any particular concern? I do. Yes, sir. My wife has uh, diabetes and she's lost some of the vision from it. Mm. It's getting worse. So I'm in prayer for her. What's your name? Shannon. Shannon. Rose. Anybody else? Oh, I forgot the test. Uh -oh. Well, that's all right. Next time. Oh, darn. Let's go to God in prayer. God, thank you for Kurt and his mom and the chance for them to get together over the last few days, God, to get out of the house and a meal to just see the joy what it means to be around his earthly mom. I thank you for that privilege, God, and we just pray for a blessing on that visit. Pray for blessings on his way back. Uh, keep him safe, God, and return him to his family here. Uh, thank you for uh, JW and putting on weight and really eating well. And pray over Elizabeth and Cody as they are new parents. And thank you for the mothers that are present here mothers that have passed. For some mothers, it's a painful day that have had to suffer loss. But we remember the joy of the smiles, even as my wife and I looked at some pictures and just smiled. We thank you for those memories, God, and may we continue to remember that. We pray for Shannon and her diabetes, God, that you would heal her, that you would give the doctors wisdom that they would have the appropriate medication and the appropriate remedies that need to go along with that, God. Give her patience in that process and give everyone wisdom as they choose what course of action is next. God, we thank you. We, we give you all the honor and glory, God, and we pray that we would share those Starbucks and people the way they should be. We thank you in Jesus' precious name. Amen. Amen. Well, let's stand and and end with our closing song, Loving God and Loving Each Other.